Hey guys, welcome back and today, guys, today I'm going to be discussing with you guys a pretty important issue in Clash of Clans. So as you guys know recently, uh, the Valkyries, guys, the Valkyries have just been so, so, so insane. So today I'm going to be talking to you guys about my viewpoints about the Valkyries. Do I think they'll get nerfed? Do I think they'll stay the same? Do I think, I don't know, just all about them. And uh, in the background, I'll show you guys a couple of raids from actually our last clan where we were able to win this one now 42 to 38, I believe. So it was a pretty, pretty solid clan. Or so, so I will show you guys a couple of raids in the background with us actually using Valkyries. And uh, yeah, guys, so really, as you guys know, the Valkyries recently have just been so, so, so insane. I mean, just seriously, they're just everywhere. I mean, personally for me, guys, I in our clan, we have anywhere from Town Hall 8 to Town Hall 11. Seriously, just everyone in our clan is using them. Even some Town Hall 7s, and it's just really, really, really insane. Actually, no, I don't think Town Hall 7s are using them. I take that back. I don't even think they have them unlocked. Sorry about that, Town Hall 7s. But, uh, yeah, I mean, just so, so many people are using them. Basically, like, 90% of our clan are using Valkyries. So really, I want to talk to you guys about today is, uh, do I think they'll get nerfed? And, uh, yeah. Alright, so guys, honestly, I think they will get nerfed. Uh, this is really a, uh, you know, just the thing, why do I think they'll get nerfed? Is because, as you guys know, they just have been so, so, so insane recently. I mean, guys, let's face it. I mean, if you see a single troop... At anywhere from Town Hall 8, 9, 10, and 11, and, and like in all of trophy pushing, in matchmaking, just everywhere. There's definitely a, a, that, that troop is definitely a bit iffy, and yeah. So I think they will get nerfed, uh, you know, as you guys know, actually, there was a small nerf to level 2 to 4 Valkyries, which, uh, which actually came uh, a bit after the update had just dropped. I, I don't think it really did much, though. But it didn't nerf them a little bit, it didn't, but it did not even touch level 5 Valkyries. And guys, level 5 Valkyries are just insane. Now, as you guys can see here, actually, this attack was done by 100 Diamonds. He just basically face rolled like 100, I mean, not 100, oh god, 100 Valkyries, that'd be just, oh my god. But yeah, he just face rolled about 15, 20 Valkyries into this base. Easily gonna get the two star now. He will actually not get the three star due to the pathing of his troops and the spell of sermon that he brought He will not actually be able to get three stars here, but definitely a very very solid two star by a hundred diamonds here And yes, yeah, so really just they're just so 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 insane. I mean Guys tell me down below in the comments your experiences with Valkyries, but they're just, just I mean they're just so so insane right now so I do think Supercell will be nerfing them in the soon future. Honestly, if I had to choose a time, I'd probably say towards the end of this month. I think end of May, early June is when they will be nerfed. And yeah, so really, I mean, just, it's just, there are just so, so, so insane. As you can see, this is actually again by 100 diamonds here. He's using 24 maxed out Valkyries against the Town Hall 9. By the way, guys, sorry if my voice is a bit scratchy right now. Uh, just hearing myself, I can tell it's a bit scratchy. Uh, it's just, you know, just, I don't know, it's just a long day, you know. But yeah. So, yeah, guys, I mean, just, I think they will get nerfed. If I had to, obviously, yes, uh, uh, end of, end of May to early June, honestly, if they were nerfed, honestly, I mean, if they don't nerf it from, uh, after that, I mean, before that, or by then, I think definitely that means that the Valkyries will not be changed, and they will just, really just be insane in this game. So, why do I think the Valkyries will get nerfed? Alright, so, I mean, they're just, they're just used everywhere, I mean... So, I mean, some some attacks, I mean, I'll give it to some of some of the attackers that use uh, Valkyries. Like, I know a couple of our Town Hall 8 to 9 that, you, that use Valkyries are very, very good with them. They deploy them very, very well, very, very strategically. They use them with other troops, and they're able to, to really make very, very good attacks and get 3 stars. But at other levels, you're just seeing complete face roll. Now, no offense to 100 Diamond here, but as you can see, he really just dropped 25 Valkyries into this base. Hey, he had really, really good spell placement, though, and that just allowed him to three-star this base. And it was definitely very, very good. So, really, what it actually here? This is my attack. I'll show you guys one of my attacks, not both. 
but you know really i mean it's just they're just so so insane i think definitely a uh, yeah, nerf would definitely be in place for them guys so let me know in the comments if you guys agree and yeah so a nerf definitely coming soon i think to them but let me tell you guys just why i personally think that they haven't nerfed them yet so guys don't think that i mean definitely supercell knows that the valkyries are insane I mean, the, the developers, they all know, every single classic, like most classic players know, that Valkyries are just completely overpowered right now, and they've been overpowered for several weeks now. So it's not like the Supercell just hasn't noticed that they've been overpowered. They know that they're overpowered, but what it really gets down to is that they just, they're really in a big, big predicament right now about nerfing them. Now, this is why I personally think why. So if you guys remember a few months ago, the Town 11 update came out, and that update had, uh, you know, Town 11, and it came out with level 3 witches. Now these witches, if you guys recall, were just mind-bogglingly overpowered. I mean, just, you saw them in literally every single army. It was just, didn't even make sense. I mean, literally, I, they were just everywhere. And, uh, 3 starring all over the place with the Valkyries, just really... I remember I was watching at the time, I'd watch a ton of like Chief Pat and uh, Galdon and stuff. I just watch their attacks and they just three star mindlessly, just just over and over and over again with the level three Valkyries. And really, Supercell, when they saw this, they, they knew that there was an issue. And what they did is they actually nerfed the Valkyries not just once, but several times. I'm mean, not the Valkyries, they nerfed the witches several times. And that really brought a bit of a predicament. So, uh, you know, why? It's because, well, look at that, hundreds and thousands of players spend so much money to get those level 3 Valkyries when they just came out, or not level 3, uh, level 3 witches when they just came out, and then uh, uh, even a lot of farmers, I think at the time, had just got into level uh, 2 witches after upgrading their town hall, upgrading their lab, and then having that upgrade finished, they were not even able to use level 3 witches for very long, and then boom, they were just nerfed. And then they were nerfed again, and then I think they were nerfed even a third time later, back when, after they really weren't even that popular, they got nerfed a third time, to the point where really, Valkyries were just awful, and really, I mean, it, just, the old level 2 Valkyries were really just better, I mean, not the low, I, I, I keep saying Valkyries, but like, the old level 2 witches were way better than the current level 2 witches, which is actually a, uh, you know, go we. Go Weho, I've I've heard, I've seen it only a few times, but it used to be kind of popular, kind of Goho with a few witches uh, at Town Hall 9. It's just not, never even seen anymore. Witches were just completely nerfed. To where they're basically just taken out of this game, just just so, so, so uh, uh, nerfed there. And then obviously recently with the, uh, with the new update, or not really a new, I guess uh, uh, the newer update, they completely buffed up the witch, the Valkyries. The Valkyries are just so, so insane now. But if they nerf them, it's going to get to the point where, well, is Supercell just making these car these uh, these troops really, really good? Just so that we could spend money on them, uh, farm all of our things on them, spend so much time farming them. The point where when we actually max them out, they're just going to be bad again? And, uh, yeah, like, personally for me, guys, uh, ever since the Valkyries became, you know, when they had their big buff, I started upgrading them immediately after my uh, my other upgrade had finished, and currently right now they are level four, working their way to level five right now. I think there's just about a week left on them until I have level five Valkyries. And guys, I'll tell you, I'd be really, really pissed if uh, if Clash of Clans just completely nerfed them right now, because I've spent millions of uh, maybe not millions, but I've spent hundreds of thousands of Dark Elixir, you know, trying to upgrade them. I have some millions of elixir, trying to get the dark elixir to get to, you know, upgrade them in my lab. And just, it'd be very, very annoying. And also, all those people, there's just thousands of people that just jump the Valkyries to level 3 instantly. So if they go and nerf the Valkyries, it's kind of like, it's really going to turn into this pattern. A lot of people are going to get very, very iffy. And they're just going to be mad at Supercell. I mean, guys, let's be honest here. If, uh, see, I don't think, yeah, all right, Val I, I was afraid Boomer didn't use Valkyrie Shipper, did. But, um, you know, it's gonna be the point where it really just, I mean, I play this game, I I upgrade stuff, I see that the game changes a little thing, makes the troop really, really good. I get the troop, by the time it's really, really good, it's not good anymore. Well, it, 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 you know, I mean, that's just really, 
not gonna make people happy, and that's why really Super Soul just hasn't, you know, nerfed them yet. It's because of that whole thing where, I mean, they could seriously, seriously get penalized for nerfing them, because it's gonna just get into that whole rhythm of just making a new troop, and then it's gonna really get into a whole, like, pay-to-win kind of thing, where, where you pay all this money, and then even after that, you don't win, so pay-to-not win. Uh, I heard that uh, spoken with, oh, sorry about that. But, yeah. Oh, yeah, but I guess, yes, I am subscribed to Clash with Camera. Uh, Clash sucks at gaming, whatever his name is right now. Yeah. All right, so, really, it's just not, it's just not really, I mean, people are just not going to like it. And, yeah, guys. So, really, tell me down below in the comments what you guys think of the Valkyries. Tell me down below if you guys prefer the uh, the newer Val. I mean, if you guys like this new Valkyrie, I, I mean, I'm sure you guys like it. But tell me down below in the comments if you guys have been seeing your clanmates use Valkyries a lot. If you get when do you guys think that the Valkyries will be nerfed? As I said, uh, end of May to early June. But I think the game has to, you know, buff up another troop a lot, or not not nerf uh, uh, Valkyries as much, or just do do something to counteract them, but then still make them very very good, because it just would not be fair if they just just made them complete, you know, garbage all over again. And, uh, yeah, guys, so as you guys can see, yes, Boomer did three, so here, very, very nice attack, Boomer, very, very nice attack to every single person that I showcased in this video, and yeah, so I'm actually gonna go grab somebody right now, I actually have somebody, sorry about the clicking if you hear it, I know it, that's a bit annoying, but just, just changing up the thing right now, uh, alright, come on, work, alright, so, uh, the random shot of the day goes out to, uh, Chris Studdard here, so, uh, his clan hashtag is hashtag, to U G C U G C zero nine J R. The clan name is called Shameless, and his name is Chris. All right, uh, Chris, your first player. Oh, Town Hall, Town Hall eleven. Wow, up in Legend League two. That's a, that's a really solid. Let me see. Wow, that's that's a really really good army to fully max out heroes and troops and stuff. Wow, very very uh very nice base, Chris. So Chris asked me, what do I think they should add to keep a clash going? Alright, so I think what he means by this is, you know, obviously this guy is a fully maxed out on 11. So he asked me, what do I think they should add to clash clan to really, maybe not keep it going, but just make it a lot more interesting. And this came into the whole idea, this was spoken about, but I, I don't know what Supercell is doing with it. But it is clan war tournaments, guys. I want to see clan war tournaments. Tell me down below in the comments if you do. Just Clan War Tournaments is going to be such a cool and just really, really cool and insane idea. I mean, just like eight different clans, they they all start into the tournament. Now with now that modding are supposedly, modding has been taken care of. I know the bans did start dishing out a few weeks ago and a lot of people have been banned for it. So now that the fair play is definitely being encouraged a lot more, this new tournament thing would be really, really cool. Maybe it gives like... Like, I mean, if you win the whole thing, you get, like, five times your normal clan XP. If you get to the finals, you get, like, three times, I guess. If you get to, like, the, the second round, you, I mean, I get to, I guess, just win one, and then you lose the next one. And I guess it would be, like, eight clans. So, I guess if you won the, if you lost the first one, then you just get your normal lose, so you just be out, and then that's it. And then if you win that one, and then you lose the next one, you get, like, double XP, or, and then if you go to the finals, you get triple, and then if you win the whole thing, you like five times clan XP. I think that'd be really, really cool, uh, you know, buff up the clan XP for clan war tournaments, make people want to do clan war tournaments. And, uh, yeah, guys, so really, I think that'd be just something that's really, really cool to add into Clash Games. Maybe not keep it going, I, I guess you could consider keep it going, but just make the game a lot more interesting, because I know, I, you guys, I haven't pushed a Legends League or anything like that yet, but I know, uh, Chris, you can tell me down below in the comments. If Legends League is just complete hell still, or if the clouds are really loosening up, I heard that still, you know, like 10 hours and stuff to find a base up there. And, you know, I know farming at lower levels really isn't that be that cool right now. So really what it gets down to is what can every single level in this entire game do? It's Clan Wars. So I think a really, really cool addition to Clan Wars. It's definitely time. It's been about two years, I think, since the Clan Wars have come out. So definitely, I think it'd be a really, really cool addition to the game if they added Clan War Tournaments. And, uh, yeah, guys. So, tell me down below in the comments if you guys enjoyed. If you guys agree with me, tell me down below in the comments if you... Just tell me all your opinions down below in the comments. Also, guys, make sure you guys leave me your random shoutouts of the day. If you want to be in next video, 
our feature even in the next video, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. So make sure you guys comment, like, and subscribe for daily Clash videos. I think tomorrow will be Super Showcase Saturday, so I'll see you guys then. So peace out, and as always, Clash on.